houses are getting decorated and pumpkins are ready to carve, but are you ready for Halloween? The final countdown to the fun-filled day is upon us and many people wait last minute to find their costumes, leaving many scrambling. Something reflected at the local costume rental shop. It's a little bit slow, but Fort St. John is a very last minute town, so that's normal. I will get the parties start Friday, so I will get busy like Wednesday afternoon. <laughs> so that's normal. I, I answer a lot of emails, a lot of texts right now, and, and I have a kind of steady-ish flow of people. It won't get insane until, like I said, Thursday, Friday. Lindley says when she first started this business 11 years ago, it was her way to give something to the community that it never had before. I'm born and raised here and, and I believe in supporting local and, and doing things local and having Fort St. John be that place that you can do anything you want to do and have fun. So this was my contribution to the town saying, listen guys, we can do anything. She says her costume selection is for adults only and there is a good reason for that. If I were a kid, I don't want to return my costume the next day. I want to play in it and Walmart provides them for cheap. They can play in them all year. They can wreck them. Don't care. The adults are the ones that, that, you know, they're more expensive and their options are more limited. So this is my adult playground, I call it. And she has pretty much every kind of costume you can think of, from a fairy tale princess and knight in shining body armor to a yeti or even a bacon suit. She says this year's most popular costumes so far have been Mario and Luigi. Leah Murray, CJDC-TV News, Fort St. John.